Wyland High School has an intro to construction course for students who want a future in construction. We interviewed Ms. Brayer, the teacher of this course, about the projects and safety of this course. Um, well, first we start off with safety, and then we start off with uh, hand tools, because I think it's really important everybody knows how to use a hand saw and a hammer and things like that. And then we, we progress along and start to learn then about power tools, because not everybody has all the fancy band saws or table saws. They were more apt to have a hand saw. So we make sure they have that, but then they also understand the aspect of um, if they do have an opportunity to work with those fancy things. So um, I hope they come out, one, knowing how to be safe around tools, two, that they can use hand tools, especially if they've never been taught, and three, that if they have exposure to fancier tools, they're not like, <gasps> scared to death about it, but um, that they have that opportunity. As one would expect while working with heavy machinery, in Ms. Breyer's class, safety is a top priority. You might be able to make it without a finger, but <laughs> no, we try to make sure that they understand where to place their hands, where, where to, to keep all their body parts to keep them safe, tie their hair back, um, and we go over quite a few rules uh, that they have to do and I go over them uh, repeatedly, so PPE. Well, it basically helps me understand if you can measure, if you know how to think outside the box, literally and figuratively, and then once they have showed me that they can make a box, I have some examples in the room. Uh, matter of fact, I ended up with a triangle box. I ended up with a, a long box. So you don't have to think of it just as a cube. So it's to push uh, creative thinking, critical skills, and um, then after they have come up with that design, that mock-up, I make them do it in a harder tag board uh, so that it literally would fold or you could put it in a, a gift. Miss Brayer has been around tools her whole life, and as a child, her passion for construction came naturally. Um, I, this sounds silly, I was a daddy's girl, so I was always hanging out with him. I was always in the garage with him using his tools, and he got tired of finding his tools out and not being able to find them. So for when I was six years old, that's what I got for Christmas was my own tool set, and then he built me my own workbench. So from then on, I was only allowed to use my tools <laughs> and uh, use it, work on my, my projects on the workbench. So I guess my hanging out with my dad. I've made my own desk. Um, it's eight foot by four foot. And I did that several years ago. Um, and my husband still uses it today. So yeah, for his, his artwork stuff.